Hey guys, what's going on? It's KFMZ here, back with another video. Today we are back with Clash Royale on my main account for once. And I'm here with a new balance changing deck that has been really good for me. If you look in the my battle log, I have win, 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 draw, win, draw. And that's when I started using the deck. This deck is good against all kinds of decks, it appears, because you see Elite Barb's deck. You see Royal Giant deck, Royal Giant Elite Barbs deck, another Royal Giant Elite Barbs, Lava Hound. So this deck pretty much counters everything. Here I'll show you one of them and how to, I countered the Royal Giant. And this one was extremely close. Let's just put it that way. So not the best starting hand here. So I'm just thinking how can I stall out Elixir. This was one way, distracting. And then... Here he comes with his Royal Giant. So, I went Skeleton Army because I don't have my Inferno Tower yet. And he's zapped. So, right there he's already off to an early, like, 500 uh, hit point lead. Make that 700. And not the greatest of start. But then the main push for this is Hog Freeze. It is very good. So, I go Hog right here. And then he places Barbarian, so I wasn't able to get all of it. I tried it there, but it just misses the wizard. But then I log it all, and I get my fireball out. And then he comes in with the Hog Rider, which I was just not ready for. So that's going to get some more damage. And instead of defending the Hog, I defended the, uh, the Spear Goblins in the back. So they didn't get tanked for front by the Hog. So, now we're off to an early uh, loss, I guess. But this deck is uh, good. Like, if you're behind, you don't have to worry because you can play defensive with Ice Wizard, Skeleton Army, Inferno Tower. You can even use a defensive free spell, which I like to do sometimes. So, here we go. Ice Wizard in the back. Here he, building up push. He has not seen my Inferno Tower yet. Oh, yes, he has. But yeah, Inferno Tower counters Royal Giant perfectly. See, he has his zap ready, but remembered my Skeleton Army. So if he zaps the Inferno Tower, then I go Skeleton Army. If he zaps the Skeleton Army, you can go Inferno Tower either way. And then right here, he didn't have enough Elixir to defend this, like, very well. So I'm able to, to get a good freeze on every single defensive troop. And then right here again, he goes Hog. And I go Skeleton Army. Which, of course, he then zaps. So, this gets lots of damage off to the tower. Brings it all the way down to 286. Then he'll go this. Since he just uses zap, he has nothing to counter the Inferno Tower on. And then I go on a hog push right here. And I, I have my free spell already. I freeze. I was trying to wait to see if he dropped our barians. He never did. So then, I sent this, which was not the best. But I was just trying to hit the tower. And so then I was able to log, and then I went Skeleton Army Minions, which was pretty good. He fireballs, so it brings my tower down to 35, and then I go Hog, because I needed to take out the tower. He goes Royal Giant, 3, 2, 1, and the Royal Giant never got the shot off. So I won by 35 hit points. Yet, this deck is very good. For balance changes, and now we'll hop into some live battles. So, here we go. Alright, first one is up against a guy from the clan of T4B Design. Because I do not know what that means, or what language that is even in. So, let's start off with an Ice Wizard in the back. Get a little build up going. Get the hog ready to go. Now, he's going to start a push over there, so I'll go... That, that, get my log ready. Let's just log all of that. Now let's fireball this on that side. Boom. Oh, if only we could hit the musketeer, but let's do that. To also hit the musketeer. And he completely missed them, so the elite barb's got nothing out of that. Musketeer does do some work on that side. But overall, I'm fine with that, considering I did not have the most elixir to defend that or the best troops. So now we can start up another push in the back with the Ice Wizard. 
Sorry guys, I am a little sick, but I felt like making a video on this new deck. So he's going to try going into that. I'm going to see if I can get it over there. Yep, Hog hops over the river, gets the Inferno Tower to target it inside of the Ice Golem. Now we can go on our own push. He hasn't seen the freeze spell yet, so he doesn't know it's here. Now we will freeze all of this, and that is going to do lots of damage. Now right here, don't have the most elixir to defend this. Because of the free the ice wizard's freeze, I can then fireball boom, and that was perfect. And so now we have a good lead right here, guys. Now we can get ready for another ice wizard push. Uh, we can start the back. Oh, all right. Not sure if he has more elixir than me or if he just started it because he had enough to do the push he wanted. Let's go ice wizard to slow down anything that he puts. Now getting ready for the hog. So right now, he's going to fireball. I'll go minions on the musketeer. Now let's go hog. Okay, he zaps. Now let's just free spell. Come on. Yes, free spell gets off in time. That should bring it pretty low. Now let's fireball this. Come on. Okay, hit at least two of them. So that's fine. Now we do this. Now let's log. And let's go minions. Okay, didn't do that much damage. Okay, but now let's do this. Get our fireball ready. Here, wait a second. He just did that. That was his defense for the hog rider. Let's go this. Now get the free spell ready. Right there. Boom. Oh, wow. Great defense on his part. So let's do this. And this. That is not going to do enough. Luckily, it hit all of that. And now, maybe. Ice Wizard. Boom. Boom. Come on, minions. He missed the tower on that. And that will help a lot. Come on, come on. Level 7 will not do enough damage in one swing. But it won't even get the swing off. Just barely squeezing out that win as well. So, yeah. A lot of close games with this deck. But managing to pull through with it. Let's see this. Okay. So, let's hop into one more battle here. Maybe two. Depends on what happens here. Alright. So, up against MSV. Not sure if that means anything. But, that's his name. Now, let's... We have a decent starting hand. Okay, he's gonna go that. I'll do this. And this. And now, that shouldn't do any damage at all. He even misses some of my skeletons with that. Not the best log. I think he was just trying to do damage to the tower. But now the ice wizard. Nope, not going to do any damage. But he did have to use elixir for my defense. So, I'm fine with that. Good first starting push for him. For, or good starting defense for me. So, let's start up with this and this. Get the free spell ready. And he's going to go goblins. I'll do that. Princess won't do too much to the hog rider. He's going to fireball. That was smart. Now. Okay. Let's do log. Now. We're going to have to do something about that. Uh, furnace in the back. Because otherwise that's going to do lots of overtime damage. So let's just do that. Now. We could fireball. But I want to save my fireball. Here. Let's do. Alright. That's fine. If they're both going to jump into the Ice Wizard. Because I don't have to waste. And then those two are also going to jump in. Alright, can I reach? No, here. Let's do this. This. Hopefully take that out. Boom. Boom. Let's do that. And now, that's good. That shouldn't do any damage to my tower. Alright, well the Fireball will. But the Goblins, yeah, they will because of it. Let's do that. Okay, still have a lead, but I do think he is beating us with Elixir. Luckily, Double Elixir is starting up just now. So, here we go. Don't have the greatest hand right now. Let's do Ice Wizard right there. Now, let's just do Log. Alright. Oh, come on, come on. Yes! It hit all of that. Come on, don't kill all of them. Alright, that's fine. Now let's fireball. Now let's go on our own push. Boom. Get the freeze ready. Let's do that. 
let's defend his push while ours is still doing some more damage than his is. Alright, so he's going to do that in the middle as like a defensive sort of furnace. So now let's fireball and let's do minions right there and let's log all this. Boom, boom. Alright, now the minions might do some damage. He's going to have to defend the minions. So now we should have a little more elixir, hopefully. Let's do this. Let's do free spell. Now let's do ice wizard to slow him down. Meant to do skeleton army, but still managing to pull off another win with this deck. This deck is great, but you do need some cards for it. But hopefully you guys do have these if you're up as high as I am. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoy. Please leave a like and subscribe if you did. Tell, leave in the comments any good deck ideas or any other types of videos I should do. And see y'all next time. Bye!